So I play a warrior, a control warrior that doesn't have uh, armor smiths. And I also play with crutch. So we'll see how this goes. Kinda really want to match up with a control warrior as well, just to see roughly how it goes. Sweet. I really hope that this is not some miracle enraged warrior. I really want to see the long run of this. Oh yeah, and I play with uh, Bouncing Blade and Azure Drake. It's kind of weird. Instead of using Shield Block, I use Azure Drake just for the board for damage, if I can. I mean, it still dies to the death bite, but I drew a card and I took some armor off, so. Shield block is nice, but the shield maiden covers the shield block, so I don't need the shield block. I feel like the shield block is too passive. So yes, I do play the bomb lobber that people are suggesting, but I don't play with armor smith, so I never do. And I actually don't have cruel taskmasters as well. So you see how this goes. So he got the war axe, and I didn't. So he's up in the lead. There's my crush, that's fine. That's fine if he doesn't play anything. Sweet. Now I can Azure since he just wasted his weapon. There's my Moto Strike. There's the first shield slam. So I'm just keeping in mind that he has used one shield slam. I can take the hit. So here I'm going to test if he has the other shield slam or he's going to spend an execute. So this is just to keep count. Oh, there's the bomb lover. Okay, fine. So he's not going to use the execute, but he's going to use that. So since you play Bound Lover, I'm going to counter his Bound Lover with my Bound Lover. Yep. There's my Siege Engine. It's perfect. So I'm one up on him now with the Bound Lover. There's the Dead Spite. There's his Shield Block. It's fine. So he has used one. Shield slam and in one bomb lover. So here I'm basically baiting him to uh, get rid of his armor. There's the execute. So that's a second bomb lover. So let's counter his bomb lover again. So both of us have to use both bomb lovers. And both times I was the one that come out ahead with the bomb lover. It's funny, huh? So one shield slam, one execute, two bomb lovers. There's the get in. I guess I'll just use my bouncing blades on get in. I can save my BGH for something else. 
like that. I mean, either way, it was probably the same thing in general. I've got the beast in my side. Let the pain speak to me. Back to work. There's one cruel taskmaster. It'd be nice if I draw my fiery war axe, but no, I don't. So this kind of sucks for me. I have to waste my weapon. But of course, I'll take one less. So I believe he used one of each already of the clearings. There's the Shield Maiden. Guess I can use the Shield Slam here. Yeah, I don't want to like risk my armor because I'm I'm below health. So, I cannot risk taking damage like that. Because he still has his second Cruel Taskmaster and most control warriors... Oh, he plays with double shield blocks. Most control warriors, the old school one, always rely on Cruel Taskmaster number 2 with Gromish. So here I'm just going to activate the bombs and use my Execute. Belcher. That's fine. There's a second crew taskmaster. Okay, fine. The way that you played means that you're not gonna have your Gromage combo. You're basically gonna use your second death bite as the Gromage combo. So I'm gonna mortal strike here. Yeah, play my low thing. Armor Smith. There's the second death spite. There's my win X. So, here I'm just going to use my Gromesh. I believe I'm going to use my Gromesh because there's nothing else I can do. But, no. He has that weapon, so it's best that I use Sylvanas here just to steal. I was thinking about Gromeshing, um, but he has two creatures, so it's kind of dangerous. So here I'm hoping to steal his armor smith, but I didn't. So he has a lot of health, but health doesn't really matter all that much. Um, he did draw more cards than I have, so he's um, slowly wearing down on cards. So here I'm just going to use a defensive Gromish. That was probably a misplay, but uh, what I wanted to do was to draw out his uh, removals. And there's the second shield slam. 
And the reason for that misplay is because I really need my weapon to kill something bigger than that. Uh, but I guess I could have hit his face uh, instead to remove more armor. But he's already used the shields now, and I want to feature Rag more, so that was a misplay by me. Um, but I wanted to kill something bigger instead of a 1-2 Armorsmith. I could really have hit his face earlier with Gromesh, like everyone does. So here, it, it really didn't matter in a way that I could have not hurt my... I could have went for the... the Belcher first and not hurt both rags. But here's the thing, if I don't hurt one of them and if he steals one of them, then I'm in trouble. So it's best that I just hurt both of them just in case. So here's his other execute. So he has to find some way to kill this one. So here I'm going to use my second death spike. And just use the inner rage because I already used my Gromish. In fact, earlier I kind of misled I could have done something else. But it's about the same thing. I just want to feature Rag more. Um, people underestimate the power of Rag uh, right now. So that's his second armor smith. Um, but if he doesn't have brawl yet, he's gonna be in trouble because all the work that his uh, he that he pumped with for armor is now wearing down, and he's running out of cards. So he's gotta have a brawl have at some no point. So this is why I wanted to hurt. You know, rag. I mean, I have crush, but I didn't see my executes, and I really want to see the other execute. And this is nice that I can avoid um, hurting rag uh, with my face because I am behind. In terms of being down from his Alexstrasza, so this shot uh, was kind of bad. But, in general, that's what I wanted to see, because I have my Execute in hand. So this is why um, I have it, and there's a good crush. And he already used both Gromishes, so, and he used both Death Spites, so he cannot really activate this Grom uh, Gromish, which is why I have Crush waiting. And Crush was waiting uh, Gromish the whole time. So here, I just execute the rag that he stole from me, which is the easiest way out. And I didn't have to use my face to hurt rag. So, in a way, that misplay was just to wait for um, him taking my rag. Because I know that he has Sylvanas. I mean, most control warriors do. So here, I'm just going to play my second uh, Shield Maiden and hit his face. Uh, the reason why I hit his face is because he's uh, running on fatigue. And I have my second win X, so it's fine. So I haven't seen the brawl. And I just drew my Dr. Boom. My Dr. Boom was last card. But I haven't seen the brawl, so I'm not going to put down Dr. Boom yet. So even though he Alex, he can't remove my armor. That's just bad. Well 